To create your own Viking ship, you're gonna need two empty plastic bottles, two rubber bands, these three pieces of craft foam that are in your kit. You have two rectangles that are about the same size and then one smaller, almost a square. Um, you also have a baggie with some scraps of other colors of craft foam and all of these have um, paper on the back and they're sticky so you can peel that off and use them like stickers. Um, and then you also need this wooden stick and this dragon head template. So gather up all your supplies and let's get started. So first thing we're gonna do is create our dragon head. Um, it's called the hull, the front of our ship. Um, most Viking ships had a, either a dragon or some sort of kind of scary creature on the front of their ship because they thought that it would help them scare off sea monsters or any evil spirits that were out there in the ocean. So what you're gonna do is get this template and cut this out if you would like to use it. There's lots of free space over here if you would like to design your own dragon head or other creature, you could do that over here and create your own template. But what you'll need to do is cut either this one out or your own design and then pick out one of these pieces of foam. These two rectangles are about the same size. Pick one of them to be um, what color you want your dragon to be. I think I'm gonna go with yellow. So cut, um, design if you want, and then cut this out, and then we'll trace it onto our foam. Once you have a dragon traced onto your foam, go ahead and cut that out. Next up, we are gonna construct the body of our boat. So for this, you need that other bigger rectangle of foam, your two bottles, your two rubber bands, and we'll need that dragon head. To do this, you're gonna set your two bottles side by side, just like this, and take your dragon head and this part right here is gonna go in between your bottles. So just like that. So you can see there it's kind of stuck in between. Then you are gonna take this piece of foam and set it on top of the bottles. It'll be right behind the dragon head. And then all you have to do is take your rubber bands and wrap them around. Now, because there's air inside these bottles, you could take this to your bathtub or to the lake and this would float just fine all on its own. We're gonna add a few more things to it, but you have built a working boat. All right, next up, we need to give this boat a sail. So for this, you need this smaller piece of craft foam that's kind of a square shape, almost a square, and this wooden stick. And on your craft foam, you might see that you have two little dots. I don't know if you can see them here on mine. Okay, where those dots are, that's where we're gonna put two tiny little snips with our scissors to make a hole for our mast, our wooden stick to go through. So just take your scissors and just, you can kind of fold right where that dot is and give it a little snip. It just needs a tiny little hole like that. Okay, do that on both dots. And then you're gonna take your stick, you probably have kind of a pointier end on, on one. You're gonna take your stick and poke it through. Kind of wiggle it in there, okay? And then poke it through this hole as well to bring it back to the front. Just like that. Now once you have your sail made, we've got, we've come to the fun part. Um, and grab your bag of all of these different colors 
And now you get to decorate your sail. So you might want to um, stick on, maybe you make some sort of like coat of arms that goes here in the middle of your sail. Um, you can make that out of these stickers. You could create some sort of shape for your crest. and stick that on there. And then if you want to draw on this foam with either pen or markers um, to decorate it further, that might look cool. Your, your sail might have some stripes. A lot of Viking ships had stripes on their um, cloth sails. Whatever you want. This is where you get to let your imagination take over um, and create something cool. Remember, you want your ship to look really fierce and you want people, if you were sailing in the ship, you would want people to know who was coming when they saw your sail. So make your sail really unique and so it says something about you. When your sail is all decorated, now we need to mount it onto our boat. So this um, mast, the wooden stick part of our sail is gonna poke through this layer of foam right here. So what you need to do is grab your scissors and give that a little tiny snip like we did before in our sail. Okay, just poke that through, be very careful. And then all we have to do is stick that mast down through there and it's gonna go down between the layers, uh, between the bottles. You can see it going down in between there. Okay. And now our boat is ready to sail. The final step is just um, adding a little uh, decoration to our dragon. We can add some decorations along the side. A lot of times um, when we see the Viking boats, they had all of their round shields on the outside for protection, so you could add some of those out of your um, craft foam. Be creative and make this look like your own very special personalized Viking longship. Once you have added all of your Viking shields and decorated your sail, your Viking longship is ready to hit the water. Thanks for making with us today.